1946, Convair designed and built an airplane to meet airline and military requirements for a short and medium range aircraft with a high payload at a minimum operating cost. This is the plane identified as the 240. It has an unequaled record for passenger safety, dependability, and economy of operation. One of the most unique features is the built-in stairway, designed as an integral part of the aircraft. This loading arrangement saves time for airline operators as well as passengers. Convair engineers develop this orange peel cowling to facilitate engine inspection at service points or terminals. The 240 was designed for fast, efficient servicing and maintenance. The engines, each packing 2,400 horsepower, give the airplane a 100% power reserve at all times, both in takeoff and in flight. The 240 is an all-metal low-wing monoplane with full cantilever wing and tail sections. It is equipped with a tricycle landing gear, which keeps the plane level on the ground and adds to the maneuverability while taxiing. Maximum gross weight for takeoff is 39,500 pounds with a payload of 8,900 pounds. It takes off well under the 3,800 foot runway length required by the CAR. With an ample three quarter of an hour fuel reserve, the 240 has a range of 830 miles and cruises at 300 miles per hour. Pressurized cabins maintain comfortable flight conditions regardless of altitude or rate of climb or descent of the airplane. The combination of the features shown on this airplane, its safety service record and minimum operational cost, make the 240 the outstanding short and medium haul airplane of its day. With the success of the 240 established, it was only natural for Convair to think in terms of building a newer and larger airplane. As a result, the 340 Convair liner was introduced in October 1951. This is basically a new airplane with a longer fuselage, a higher gross weight, more powerful engines, and many interior design improvements. The increased wing area, power, and fuel capacity enables airline companies to employ the 340 not only for short-range schedules, but also for medium-range hauls, which were previously serviced by four-engine equipment. The design of the 340 allows maintenance and service crews to perform their jobs simultaneously. This means economical operation and time saved between hauls. This is the only commercial airliner designed with fuel tanks outside and away from the engine nacelles. This is another important safety feature. Hot food is easily loaded aboard for hungry passengers who will dine aloft. With servicing and maintenance quickly and accurately accomplished, the ship is ready to go on the next leg of its flight. For passenger convenience, the hydraulic loading door is on the forward left side as the most functional location. At airline training schools, pilots are taught to take off and fly the Convair liner on a single engine. After a short run, the plane takes off easily and clears the theoretical 50-foot obstacle at the required point with no difficulty. Other airline companies who use Convair liners know that this airplane has one of the highest safety records of any airplane flying today. It flies and climbs easily on one engine. Because of its performance and proven reliability, the Convair 340 airliner was purchased by 21 domestic and foreign airline companies as well as 11 private industrial firms. The United States Air Force and the Navy ordered modified versions for military training and transport duty, bringing the total number of Convair airplanes in operation throughout the world to over 1,000. Larger tires carrying lower air pressure are an improvement, giving the airplane better handling characteristics on unimproved runways, on ice or in snow. Heavier gear and softer tires reduce maintenance. 
dual tires on the gear ensure against blowout failure. Beginning with this Convair 240, billions of passenger miles were flown by these airplanes, establishing an unequaled safety record, with more than 3 million hours of flight over almost 675 million miles of air travel. With the introduction of the 340, the reliability and safety records of the Convair liner continued to grow. From these aircraft came the Metropolitan 440, a new airplane with all the good qualities of its predecessors and a number of major improvements. The many features that have given Convair transports one of the best operating records of any commercial aircraft have been retained in the Metropolitan 440. The home of the 440 liner is in San Diego, California. All the vast resources of this plant are combined to make this twin-engine airliner one of the most efficient and practical of any airplane flying today. The construction is based on proven design with many new features. The huge wings were subjected to tests equivalent to 50 years of airline service. First, the interior of the passenger cabin is covered with sound damping foil. Next, thick acoustical blankets are added to reduce noise and vibration to a minimum. These airplanes are manufactured under the watchful eyes of skilled craftsmen on this modern production line. In this new versatile model, operators are offered their choice of the standard 44 passenger version or the newly designed expanded seating capacity model which will accommodate 52 passengers and a crew of four. The maximum usable fuel capacity is 10,380 pounds. And at average speeds of 289 miles per hour, the maximum range is about 1,210 miles with a payload of 12,880 pounds. The 440s roll off the assembly line on schedule and with the colors and striping of the airline company that will use them. Now they will receive all ground tests and be made ready for first flight. After each airplane is checked out and flight tests are completed, airline representatives take over and fly the airplane to its home base. The cockpit is in modern styling with wide range of visibility and windows that will remain free of fog, frost, or ice. The instrument panels and all controls are positioned to facilitate every operation in flying the airplane. The placement is truly functional and acclaimed by pilots, both commercial and military, the world over. Electronic equipment in the 440 includes new and improved medium-high and very high frequency radio communication sets, instrument landing equipment, and intercommunication facilities. Airline and military operators will notice a new look in the Metropolitan's nacelle. The exceptionally clean lines are further streamlined with an increased taper at the forward end and a rectangular exhaust port at the aft end, deflecting the noise down and away from the plane. The new silencer, developed after extensive engineering, reduces exhaust sound levels to a quiet whisper in the passenger cabin. The greatest aid in all weather flying available for these airliners is the weather mapping radar installation. This enables pilots to avoid or minimize the discomfort and delay resulting from severe turbulence. The seeing nose makes tornadoes, storm centers or other bad weather visible to the pilot as far as 150 miles ahead. By being able to route an airplane through an area of least turbulence, passengers are assured of a smooth flight without the disturbance of lightning strikes, hail or buffeting. Thus the airborne radar, coupled with all the other improvements in the 440, brings a new era to air travel, assuring passengers the utmost in comfort and safety.